Yeah, I said before, I think we make some, some good goals and we showed some, some good things. And uh, yeah, we are on a good way, but still, I think uh, there is uh, still a lot of uh, space for improvement. And uh, so, yeah, we, we keep going, train hard, and that's it. You know this manager probably more than, more than most people at Manchester United. Is, is he good at getting his message across and what is he trying to get you to do collectively? So, so many things, uh, but I think yeah, he uh, he's, uh, he has, he likes the details as well, and um, yeah, he asks a lot from you as a player. You have to be fit to play his, his style of football, um, but I think we have the uh, the right players for that, and um, so yeah, uh, we just have to keep going and uh, uh, repeat all the time, and then we will uh, we will improve. I'm sure. People have said that this would be a positive for you. In particular, because I would imagine your time at Manchester United has been a bit frustrating. I don't know. Yeah. Um, to be fair, uh, if you didn't play good, I will not play. So, so that's it. You know. I, on the end, I, I need to play uh, good for myself. And like everyone, yeah, you have to play good uh, to play uh, with this manager. Like every manager. So, uh, yeah. That's. Um, I. That, 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 yeah. That's it. Johnny. Sorry. Johnny. Just one more. Have you been able to work out in your own mind why you've not been able to get to the level that people know you're capable of since you've been at Manchester United? Uh, good question. Of course, you think a lot about, about football, but on the end, you need to stay yourself and you never have to change as a player. So, yeah, it also uh, depends on which manager is in the club and which kind of players uh, does he like. So. Uh, I just do my best and um, and I have to push every day and of course uh, everyone can improve and me as well so um, I'm always uh, looking how uh, I how I can improve. Donny, you know the Ten Hag philosophy inside out. What have you noticed so far from pre-season that's very Ten Hag that your teammates have now adjusted to? Oh, different things. I mean in the pressure you could see already uh, a bit uh, different things than before but also in building up a lot of variations and what I said I think still we can um, improve a lot of things but yeah it, it uh, seems like positive and we just need to keep going and, and train good. We already see the team winning the ball back a lot more as you say building from the back a lot more comfortable in possession movement switching off the flanks and all that what do you think he wants to see from you guys taking it further? Uh, yeah, we just have to keep the ball and on the good moment, uh, yeah, we, what, what you say, we have to switch it and uh, on the right moment we speed up and um, I think so many things uh, like yeah, a lot of details so it's hard to, uh, to explain uh, but so many things but um, yeah, um, what I say, it, it seems like positive but still we can improve. There's a lot of players that have been criticised of which you are one but now that seem under this manager to be full of confidence again, like Anthony Martial, Eric Bailly, Marcus Rashford. Do you feel that he's come in and given you guys greater self-belief, that he's told everyone this is a new start? No, of course, for everyone it's a new start. I mean, uh, there is a new manager, of course, and, and new chances for everyone, not only for me or for Martial or, or Bailey, just for every player and everyone wants to show it. And um, so, yeah, of course, um, I think that that means for everyone. When you heard the news that Eric was going to be coming in, was there quite a big part of you that was pretty happy that it was him or anyone else? No, yeah, I don't know. Of course they say this because I had him in Ajax, but again, you know, on the end you have to play good for, me, for from yourself and uh, it doesn't make any sense who is the coach. Um, yeah, you need to, to find your role in the team and um, of course he knows me as a player, but still um, that, that says nothing, you know, it, I have to show it for myself. When you look at your performances and your time in England, how have you reflected on so far? I, I don't think everything was bad. I think I also play a f uh, I show a good f a few moments, uh, but just again, I will never change as a player. Of course, um, you can things improve, um, but on the end, yeah, what I say, you never has, uh, have to change, and I will not do that. I, every every player has his own qualities, and me as well. So yeah, that's it. Are you aware of just how much the fans appear to have taken you on board? It might not happen best of times so far, but the fan support for you every time there's a match, it's where's Donny, there's, there's a lot of 
love and support you. Are you aware of that? No, I think yeah, that's positive. You know, uh, yeah, that they like me and, and yeah, they know I will always uh, give everything. And uh, yeah, I hope uh, one day I will give them uh, something bad, uh, back. But uh, yeah, it gives you confidence as well, and it's it's a good feeling. And finally, I just wanted to ask about the reaction to Harry Maguire. There's a bit of puzzlement up in the stands from from us. I just wanted to put the players spoke about it. We're aware of it. No, uh, yeah, I, I hear it as well, and I think, yeah, I didn't know really what happened, but I think if if I saw the game today, I think Harry was playing uh, really well, and uh, he was, uh, yeah, aggressive. He, he, he gets so many balls, and so uh, that means he has a big, uh, big personality, and uh, yeah, you never, he has a lot of experience. So I think that's positive that uh, what he sh his performance today.